This is a Ueno Park. It's a nice little park. It's not blooming right now, so. There's a whole bunch of sakuras around here, so it's nice during the March and uh, April time frame. Just so you guys know that the uh, crows in Japan are much bigger than the crows in America. So if you're interested in going down to the little shrine temple down there, you have to go down these steps through the uh, Ueno Park. Oh, the zoo is also down there. I'd give the zoo a four out of five because it's good, but it's not great. It's a little bit hard to get around, but in general, they have a lot of good animals and they also have little African pygmy dormices, which are cute. Bigger DC zoo or here? Uh, I actually say this one is bigger uh, than I the DC. Yeah. DC doesn't have as many animals. This one has a lot more variety of animals. Uh. Of course, they both have pandas. Now, I think the DC panda enclosure is a lot better than this one. Yeah, so in the springtime, around March, middle of March usually all this way down here all the way down there will be uh cherry blossoms so it's gonna be much much nicer so we're here in the middle of uh i don't know they will allow people to have a hanami picnic this year uh that's the thing uh i heard that it should be okay now because they're downgrading the covid to the flu virus Officially, after boarding in May. So, yeah, like last year we were here, they didn't have Hanami parties. But of course, that is an interesting thing. If you have a chance to come and see, like these uh, little tanner uh, concrete, it's actually where people post up and put their. Uh, I guess tarps down there to sit, and that's where they have their uh, hanami parties. Oh, over there, the big foot head. Oh, shall we go up there, Uncle? Yeah. So there's a huge Buddha head up here. It's kind of, oh, that's a nice little uh, shrine temple kind of thing. And uh, this season, a lot of students come to wish they gonna. Past, uh, schools examinations. Oh. So you hear it. If you're going to take a test, and if you're in Japan, I don't think it's worth it if you're outside of Japan, a 14 hour flight, which is the quickest flight we found, to come and pass a test. Oh, they did not open yet. Oh. Sure. They're not From open. 10. 10 to 4. Oh, okay. Well, you can kind of see. Oh, that way. Oh. oh, you can see it here. Oh. That's interesting. And of course, you can smell the uh, incense burning here, too. Yeah, so the park is a nice little park. If you have, you know, a good afternoon, your hotel is down in Ueno. It's usually nice and quiet. Mainly just uh, people like. This is like the family area of Tokyo. So if you have a family, it's a good place to be. Uh, way better in my opinion than like Shinjuku, or Minatoku. Those places are a little bit overrated. Uh, in general, I give Ueno out of 10. It's like a, an 8.5, the kind of visit. There's a lot of stuff, especially if you have family. There's a lot of stuff in here you can do. There's parks, there's a whole bunch of shopping. There's a lot of restaurants that are good. Uh, there's a bunch of, me. if you keep going straight here, there's a whole bunch of museums that are nice exhibits. Uh, very similar to the Smithsonian, yeah. Uh, I, give those, uh, I give these museums up here. We've been in a natural history museum. Uh, I give that a seven out of 10. 
that's a good museum has a lot of interesting uh exhibits and they also have rotating like special exhibits too the last one we went to was like this dinosaur uh bone exhibit which was really awesome because they had some real life uh dinosaur bones in there of course some fake ones everyone knows especially in paleontology uh, that those dinosaurs are all fake museums because they're way too expensive and they're too fragile so you don't put them up in a the museum they'll get damaged I hate to burst your bubble on that thinking but that's the truth we got some nice little kind of horse uh some more of those occurs up here starting to bloom probably down there yeah there's a couple down there too so we'll go check that out too Oh. oh, so here's a map for the cherry blossom. Oh yeah, see yeah, that's what the route I was telling you guys. It's the main route through right now. Just so you know, during this time, it's basically wall-to-wall -wall people down there. So yeah, it's not bad. You can make it through. It's going to take you 30 minutes to walk through the park, and normally it takes 10. But it's a definite must-do at least once. There you got the zoo. And you have some other shrines, Tokyo University is up that way. Uh, and the museum's here. See, as I was saying, there's dinosaurs right there. And then there's a giant blue whale as well. So yeah, definitely. And then of course, it's right next to this uh, Ueno station. So this is a definite must come if you're in Japan. Uh, good place to stop and have lunch. And spend a good, nice, lazy afternoon.